one of the biggest challenges of graphic designers web designers ui ux designers and designers in general is understanding how to pick colors and how to mix colors in their designs and that is why i'm creating this video to show you an app that helps you by recommending colors to use for your next design project recommending color palettes you can use recommending colors you can mix for your next design projects follow me carefully and stick around in this video and show you watch this video to the end and stay subscribed i will see you in the video Right, guys so once again you are welcome to this video tutorial this is Inesky designs and like i said i'm going to be showing you an app and also how to use it this particular app is going to solve at least 70 percent if not all your color problems as a designer or maybe even as a web designer okay so follow me carefully in this video now the first thing you are going to do is to go to play store i'm going to show you the app i'm going to show you how to download it and i'm going to show you how to use it okay so please and please follow me very very carefully now the first thing you need to note is that this app is totally free you are not paying a dime before or even after you download the app so it is totally free okay so the name of the app is the name of the app is color palette okay so just search for color palette okay so the name of the app is color palette app so just search for color palette okay palette yes now there are so many apps okay there are, uh, there are so many color palette app but the one i want to show you is this particular one okay click on it and look at it this is it color palette extract and create this is the app okay you can check the review app so that you'll be sure that you are dealing with the correct app look at this is the app okay these are the reviews um this is how the interface looks like okay so like i said the first thing is to download the app okay let me cancel it i think it's trying to okay so like i said the first thing is actually to download the app my own is downloaded now the next thing you have to do is to um i have my app already so i'm just going to search it and i'm going to show you how to use it this is a very very amazing app color palette now this is the app click on the app all right so this is the app and this is how the interface looks looks like okay now when you see the app you see an option for o look at an option for extract an option for color palette this particular option is for you to create your own color palette you can see x rgb and s hsv so i may not be going into details okay so as to save time okay so that i don't waste too much time you can always explore the app on your own because the app is filled with so much possibilities okay so ensure that you just pay careful attention to what i'm going to teach you now look at this another option which is gradient from here you can form um gradients you can copy them look at it you can copy the gradient you can copy this you can use it on maybe your your photoshop your pixel lab whatever design software you are using now let's come back to home now there are so many um there are so many um colors here okay different kind of colors this first one is color schemes now if you if i click on it you will see different color palettes now you can just pick one of this color palette and use it for a old design okay you can use it for a old design i think i created a design um yeah I created a design some weeks back where I use this particular color palette. I use it just this particular color palette. All I did, all I did was just to tap. Once you tap, it copies. Okay. Once once you tap, it copies the color code. And you can always come to your pixel lab. And um yeah, you can always use the colors. All I have to do just to paste the color code. And if you're also using Photoshop, you know how to do it, okay? Color code are uh, color code everywhere that's the amazing thing okay so you can always use color palette say and with this let's say you want to create a design a flyer design social media design and you don't know what color to use you can just come here and pick a color pick a particular um color palette and play around it okay you can always play around it all right so it's very very simple you have to do just to tap once to tap the, look at it once you tap is copied already if you tap on another one like that and like that so you, you can always and also you can even tap on this like you can move this here and click on save all right so once you tap on it it's saved and um you can check your gallery it should be there okay all right so basically it's saved okay it's saved yeah you can always and i think you can always have access to your yeah, collection 
color palette okay now you can see you can see what i'm doing you can see that i save this if i want to delete it i just delete unless i want to come back to this later all you have to do is just to click on it move this to the right a bit then click on this particular icon this icon is save icon all right so that is that about that basically now let's come to gradient click on gradient let's assume that you want to work on a particular project and you need to play around with gradient you can also come here and look at there are so many gradients look at it there are so many gradients to pick from see them beautiful gradients you can pick any of them and you copy the color code so you can always um just like for other options you can just find the color palette you like okay i think i love this i'm i'm falling in love with this already okay then just tap on this okay once you tap on the color code it copies once you tap on this it copies and you can always go to your pixel app your photoshop whatever design app you are using and paste the color code and you can always use it there it is very very simple now yeah okay so you can always play around with this now the next thing i would like to talk about is material colors this particular colors are just um different shades of the same color okay you can scroll up look at you can scroll up let me check let me check green let's look at this green so you can see different shades and tints of color green different shades and tints of color when we talk about shade that's basically adding black adding black to a color okay so the that's basically shade i want to talk about tints is adding white okay so these are different shades and tints of green then that but it applies to every other color yeah you can always copy the color code by tapping on the colors or tapping on the color codes okay you can tap on the color code tap on the color code or tap on the color instead and the color code is going to be copied all right now go back the next thing is French UI colors. Okay, so look at it. These are amazing colors you can use for your UI. Look at this user interface. So it's just giving us options. Now there is flat UI. Okay, I think UI UI designers we understand this better. Now there is HTML, HTML colors. Look at it. Different colors. There is social colors. Now this one, this particular one is an interesting one because these are colors of different social media platforms. So let's assume that you want to create a a, a design for um instagram for example maybe an instagram growth flyer an instagram growth brand an instagram growth agency or whatever brand you want to create it for you can always come here and you see different colors for for different social media platforms look at this is the color for beyonds look at this is the color for facebook for messenger for twitter linkedin and all of that you can just play around with this um look at blogger look at Aka news um Look at YouTube, Pinterest. You can just play around with this particular app. So many functions. Look at this is Metro UI colors. Okay, this is Explore. Look at it. Explore colors used for Metro UI designs. Okay, I think this particular one will be more re relevant to UI UX designers. Now the next option is Extract. This particular function is an interesting one. Like a very very interesting one because one way as a designer that you can always um um work with colors or know the colors to use for your designs is by paying attention to relevant and similar designs okay so let's ask how to create a flyer for example i can just go to beyond or go to pinterest or go to any of these portfolio sites look at the designs of other people draw inspiration from them and use similar elements maybe similar elements using those designs in your so let's assume that i see a particular flyer design and i love the color shoes and i want to extract the color palette that is what this particular function is for and this is an interesting function so if i just click on just tap on this tap on this select image and you can use camera or use from gallery so you can just click on from gallery and let me just pick one amazing design that i work on recently for yeah let me just in fact you can pick this from um from pictures too so let's assume that look at it let's assume that this is the picture of um of one of my amazing coaches so if i tap on it for example it's going to pick the colors from this particular image you can see all these colors are colors that are present on him guys this is an amazing feature if you know how to maximize it all these colors are colors different colors that are um that are on the image around the um on his clothes on the background everywhere you can see them you can see the different colors and let's assume that you want to use this particular picture in a design you can always pick any color from here because any color from here is going to blend well with the colors on his 
shirt okay so you can decide to pick another one let's assume a design let me pick a design this time around let me just go to my design folder yes and let me pick this design okay let me pick this so you can see different color palettes look at it from this design look at different colors different color palette you can always tap to copy tap to copy very very simple guys very very simple and amazing okay so this is color palette this particular function is for color palette from here you can create your own color palette just tap on this then adjust you can see go to x if you have a color code already you can just paste it here and just play around okay you can just you can just play around with this you can select another color you can just play around tap on this create another palette and you can always save your palette and use them in your design look at that option for save here okay look at these are presets already okay these are already available presets then you can save your own preset you can create your own color palette here copy them and use them in your design now this particular function is for gradients okay for gradient from here you can create your own gradient this is for left this is for right this is very amazing from here you can select different colors and from here i can select different colors look at it i can reduce i can increase the shade and look at it i can play around yeah how dark and how bright it is so you can see that from here all right so basically these are the functions of this app this is a very amazing app if you know how to maximize it and with this app you will have little or no problem with picking colors selecting colors mixing colors and using colors for your designs i believe you've learned something if you follow to this point um you can tap on this look at this is for collection this particular three dots if you click on collection you will see some of your saved um if i save the color for example it's going to show here if i save the color palette or grid and they are going to show you and i can always come back to them later then this particular team i can decide to use light dark and all of this you can you can just explore this okay these are basically the settings of the app so thank you once again for following through i'm going to see you in the next video if you are new to this channel do it to subscribe if you haven't do it to like this video and i'm going to see you in the next one thank you